Hey, what's up everyone? It's Neil here with SoftModder. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Google Camera feature Lens Blur to create awesome 3D-like parallax images that you can set as your live wallpapers. Previously we showed you how to create these cool parallax images and you know there's not real practical use for them. I mean you could share them on, I believe it was um, Google Plus, but I mean you can't post them on Instagram or anything and you still can't, but Using them as a live wallpaper does make them a little bit cooler because you can actually see them regularly. Alright, so the first thing you have to do, you have to have Android 4.4 KitKat in order to have the Google camera. So if you're familiar with that, you're just going to open it up and you're going to select, it should already be there. Typically it will be like this, you just slide out and select lens blur. Now we're going to follow this prompt, let's do it using this guy. So I'm going to take a picture of this guy to create the lens blur thing. So you just focus, take the picture, and slide up. Now what we're going to do is slide to the right to process. So as this processes, I'll just tell you that when it's done, that's all you need. Or you can actually make some subtle adjustments right here. Tap right there and you can edit the focus area and you can make changes to the blurring but I don't want to make it that crazy so let's just hit done and it's gonna render it again so we have our image done I'm just gonna go back and I'm gonna use the application called lens blur live wallpaper now you can access this by hitting your menu and going to live wallpaper or just take a shortcut and hit lens blur lens blur live wallpaper go to settings down there choose the background and you're just going to select the uh, image you just did. Now, interaction method, it, it uh, basically shows, basically this determines how it's going to be viewed or activated, I guess. Uh, I use a sensor, so when I just, you'll see right now when I move my device, it'll move the image. Or you can do it by touch or home screen slide or wobble. I like sensor, so I'm going to do that one. But you can mess around and see which ones you want. You can also adjust focus and depth effect here. And there is a small watermark on the bottom right corner of the wallpaper image, but it's so subtle and it's behind the um, one of my application icons, so it's not that big of a deal. I mean, for 99 cents, you can take it off. I'm not going to waste that, but you can. So let's go back. There you go. Now set wallpaper. Now let's just show you how it looks. So you can see as my he moves around as my screen moves, and it's just cool. It gives it a it's a practical use of this awesome little feature on Google. See his head keeps looking at you no matter what. Yeah, so definitely try it out, and I highly suggest checking out the um, the article. It's detailed everything you need to know. All the uh, links are provided. So uh, yeah, check it out on SoftModder. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe for more awesome videos. And thanks for watching, guys and gals.